being authentic. When I think of authentic, I think of genuine, original, real, or true. Anything that's the opposite of fake. And the idea of being true to yourself is being true to who you are in your thoughts and your actions. Ensuring that your actions and your behaviors line up with your values and your beliefs. I have this dream of building a business and sharing my passion of resilience and performance. And part of this dream is to ensure that I am authentically me, that I am presenting my professional self, my business and my programs as me and who I am and what I believe in and making sure that they reflect on not only myself, but also what I hope others will learn from my programs, my business, and from my presentations. I'm a member of some amazing groups online. I've become great friends with some really great people. Uh, Jay Allen, who's my business coach, Tony Watley, uh, Jake Ballantyne, Alex Agresta, Dave Poole, all are great online mentors. They all have groups that I'm a, I'm a member of, and I try to interact in those groups, become a, a person who others recognize, but I do it by remaining true to myself and doing what I know how to do um, without giving up what I am. So when I interact with people, I try to be who I am. I try to present the information without going overboard and trying to be something that I'm not. And the great thing about having these people in my life is this, this, these groups that I'm a member of, the people that are uh, great mentors and great leaders in my life, they have their own way of not only supporting, but holding me accountable. And one of the recent challenges that I received from someone is about authenticity. And it wasn't because I was being fake. It's because I wasn't being fully myself. And so taking that challenge of being more fully who I am when I present online. And I thought that was a really interesting challenge because it, it wasn't derogatory and it wasn't challenging in the sense of uh, don't be don't be something you're not. It's go out and give fully of yourself and be fully who you are. And, you know, I, I tried uh, through all the videos that I've done, I, I've tried different angles and I've tried different approaches. And the best videos are always the ones that come from the heart. You can tell the ones that are overly practiced. You can tell the ones where, uh, you know, reading from a script, right? And I, I have tried some different things and, and there's always practice involved and there's always trying new things, but it always comes back to the greatest results and the greatest feeling that I get of giving is usually when it's, you know, maybe I, I, I wrote down some notes, but I'm not reading off of a script. I'm giving fully of who I am. And it's, it's a really good feeling to produce when you, the, the end result is truly who you are, fully who you are. So I'm going to continue to work on presenting myself authentically. And I encourage you, don't fake it until you make it. Face it until you make it. Uh, do what you love to do without apology. Give and provide impact to people. Um, do what you love to do and, and do it with great enthusiasm. Give an abundance and you will receive an even more abundance. Have a great day.